we're done with our meeting now and um, a lot was discussed and information will be fed back to our different constituencies in due course i am standing in front of the league of friends restaurants in the hospital so the league of friends are a group of volunteers who come together to contribute their services to volunteer their services be it um, as porters be it as um, people who give direction in the hospital even this restaurant is actually run by volunteers so for a little amount you pay uh, for a hot meal and it's a place where you can sit and interact with other staff so I want to enjoin us today to please donate to the League of Friends please donate to the League of Friends so our League of Friends aims to assist with the leisure activities and comfort of all service receivers and patients the money raised is directly for the benefit of those who use the healthcare services of Derbyshire Healthcare NHS Foundation Trust. We are wholly dependent on public funds which are achieved through donations and fundraising events. Recently, the League of Friends has helped to deliver ward tea parties, patient activity days, iPads and cameras for service receiver groups, bingo sessions at the Radburn unit, toys for the mother and baby unit at the Radburn unit, Christmas presents for all service receivers staying on a trust ward. Isn't that amazing? Annual summer fair and much more. How to donate? To donate, please call the League of Friends chair by calling 01332 551736. Alternatively, you can donate by means of a bequest, which your solicitor will help you in preparing. So yeah, they are doing the volunteering. They are doing the work on the ground so we can support to see that this beautiful um, service remains. Catch you all in another video. There's a bit of winter sun out today. Winter sun lifts our moods. And um, I sat in my car for more than a few minutes because it is so cold. It's not the kind of weather that you just want to step out like that. But it is beautiful. Oh my God. It is beautiful. This is one, one winter I have vowed to myself to enjoy. I'm not going to let myself slip into any low moods. I've put safeguards in place, made sure I have booked a lot of events because I can't be a governor of a trust that provides quality mental health services to others. And I am not safeguarding my own mental health. That is not um, being exemplary. So I've tried to book events to make sure I am outdoors most of the time because I've noticed that when we hide ourselves indoors, it seems much more overwhelming than it truly is. So get active, do stuff, do the things you like, push yourself through the winter and yeah, the difference is clear. It is cold, minus 2.5. Oh, <laughs>